Uh, sorry again, this unregistered version uh, continuously bothers me. Anyway, so when I have pressed the add music button, I have opened a file and it's looking for the wave sounds. So now I have to make sure that it reads the music file, it reads and plays the music file. So, for as I said earlier, I'm going to when I click on this add and select something here, it will be displayed here in the combo box. So for that, I will be needing a string array. I'll name it Musics. It's new string. Now in this tutorial, I'll be using just ten for ten Musics. Maybe maybe I'm not using it. You're not going to use even ten Musics. And I will need a helper or counter, I will name it index and I will define it uh, initialized to zero, set it to zero. Uh, one more thing I need a file, I will name it selected file. It will represent the file that is being selected by the J file user. I need to import the file again. So, first we have open the dialog box in the window in the browser the, that we've opened now if return value equals equals browser dot approve option that means if it selects the uh, if it selects the uh, selects anything then what we want is we want to add it to the musics and it's musics first in zero index I will, oh first I will have to use a selected file that I have defined selected file on browser dot get selected file so in this uh, in this file, the browser selected file will come up. So now, uh, I want this address. Uh, wait a minute, I, I want to show you guys what's actually happening. So let me do it first. Selected file dot to string. I want to just show you guys what is actually happening. So I'm going to use a J option pane or show message dialog. It's a built-in Java Java function. It just um, it is a window basically, a helping window. So what is actually sorry to string? So what is actually going in this one? I want to show you guys what is actually going in this one. So let's run this and add something and I want to add a wave file that's in my YouTube classes dummy sounds. Now if I want to finish audio, if I can select this, you see that's the J uh, sorry. That's the J option pane button working. It's it's giving me the path giving me the path it's the selected file that is going into the music index so we are going to be playing this music so okay well, let me see how long do I have still got 6 minutes so let's remove this I don't want this just wanted to show you guys so I have added to my main music directory now what I want is to show it into the combo box so I will write list.add item that's basically add strings I'm gonna write song uh, plus index we will be knowing what song is at what index so that's not gonna be a problem and then I'm gonna be incrementing the index by using index plus plus so let's write again and let's see add Again, I'm gonna go to the sorry, go to the directory. 
where I have some wave formats. Let me see like this one. You see, it says song one, and if I select another one, it says song two. So now I'm gonna let's add another one. I'm gonna add ten. It could add ten musics. You know, we have set the string to ten. So now uh, I think I want to finish this video because I won't be able to finish the playing sound in the next video. I'll be playing the audio file, okay?